Welcome back. So it also would not be a Thursday without Tate from Wildcat Brothers. <laughs> I'm excited that you are back. Uh, we, we, I am too. Uh, we, I think today we have a, a, a good drink lined up, uh, especially for the holidays. This is going to warm us up. Oh, and, and also for the weather. It's going to definitely warm us <laughs> well, up that's inside. Good. We need it. It's frigid <laughs> outside. It, it is. What is it? All right. So, so today the, the drink is called the apple tart. So we, we like to use a lot of juices and, and stuff and yeah. get natural ingredients. Uh, but this is, when we started thinking about for Thanksgiving, this is a nice boozy drink that you can sit and sip on all afternoon when the relatives are maybe getting a little much to you. <laughs> uh, so this starts out with our, with our MVO. MVO is our rum that we age like bourbon. So we're okay. going to be Ooh. putting it in a, a, a brand wow. new fresh charred barrel that's never been touched by any other liquid. Uh, and it's also a little higher proof, so this is 90 proof. So this is. So this will get you nice and toasty. It's going to be get you inside. toasted. So what we do for this one for the tart, we do two parts of our MVO, which is going to be our 90 proof dark rum, and then we let's go back to some juices. So this is apple cider. Pretty color too. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do one part apple cider right in here, and and now I'm using big portions, and and when I'm talking about parts, like I said before, you can use anything as a part, whether it be shot or. And, and we're making drinks for three people, so that's why I'm using larger okay. parts. So yeah, so that's the thing is, is, but if you do recipes and parts, you can use everything from a shot glass to a bucket, and it's kind of is a part like it's, a one shot or two shot. It like, could be it, it could be whatever you want. So it's okay. like it's like a single unit. So think okay. of it like that. So we did two parts of our MVO, one part apple cider, one part lemon juice is going to get a little tartness, Ooh. and then we're going to do a half a part really of simple like syrup. This. I will. So simple syrup is going to be, like we said before, half um, sugar, half water. And now we're going to kind of shake, shake it up, it up. shake it up. So like I said, this is definitely a one, you know, sip it all afternoon. Yeah, don't. Depending on your relatives. <laughs> but, uh, you know, and, and, and also, too, as we were thinking about it, we were talking about garnishes and people's and, 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 you know, as we discussed it, people said, look, this is one of these drinks where, you know, don't worry about the garnish. Yeah, uh, because, no, you know, that's there's, about there's, the other, there's other stuff um, involved in the drink. So as we take oh, a sip, wow. it's going to be Ooh. a nice little so you you get the smell. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. It's very I like it, the little fizz on top. too, And, and that, that's coming from the the, the shaking of the, the syrup. Uh, but again, as, as most of the other drinks, we're this is going to be a that is definitely tart. <laughs> sitting around, but it's good. It's tart. Like, oh wow! But yeah. it would. But one of the things again, when you look it at like it, it gets you right back here in these mm -hmm. little. Yeah, you get that little zing. Little, that, yeah. So, and one of the great things about using simple syrup in it is that you actually, um, if it's mm -hmm. too tart for you, you can also add a little more simple syrup. Yeah. One of the things about the recipes we talk about and we teach them at at Wildcat Brothers is we want you to kind of make them your own. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, we like a lot of tart things because it's it helps sometimes it's control uh, your your intake. But if you want a little more, you can put, always put some simple mm -hmm. syrup. I like the control your intake. You know, hey, we're trying. You know, we're that's trying a technical to do our term part, right? There. right? That's right. Be <laughs> responsible. Anywho, Absolutely. you guys always have a lot going on. It's happy hour today, tonight. Right? Tonight we have happy hour at Gator Cove. Um, and and we have uh, Caleb Olivier playing tonight, so it's going to be a, a a great night. We also um, on. With, uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, we also have a uh, food truck there, so Ooh. you can make a night of it. I but, love um, that. You know, a few other things we're doing at Gator Cove is if you come by a, a ride share program, say Uber or Lyft, I'll give you your first drink for free because we want you to be safe. Yeah, you yeah. want to be responsible. Awesome. Yeah, that absolutely. Really I love that you guys do that. Yeah, That's awesome. Absolutely. And if people who don't know where Gator Cove is, where are you located? So we're at 2601 Southeast Evangeline Thruway. And you can look at us, GatorCove.com. It has all of our scheduled events. Can't miss it. Go check them out. Go see them for happy hour. Try this. And great Stay with us. Cheers. I'll be right back mm. after this. Mm. At five and six, but if you need to get a little toasty. <laughs> this is the perfect drink for it. Just yes. saying. And real fast, Tate, we're almost out of time. Where are you located? Uh, 2601 Southeast of Angela Thruway, Gator Cove. Come ha visit. Happy hours tonight. Absolutely. Go check them out. Man. We'll see you right back here <laughs> tomorrow. Cheers, Bye-bye. Cheers. <laughs>